Microsoft Outlook, is one of the most widely used, email applications in the world. Whether you use it at home for personal correspondence, or at work for professional communication, there are several distinct benefits of choosing, the Microsoft Outlook desktop email client, to manage email more efficiently. Some benefits include, Outlook is commonly used in the workplace, access calendar features, manage contacts, access messages in an organized environment, use keyboard commands to quickly perform tasks and so on. Today, we will discuss some tips on Outlook. Please note, this video is based on Outlook Web. Tip number one, forward email as attachment. To forward email as attachment, just select the message you want to forward. For more actions, select other reply actions, then forward as attachment. Tip number two, organize Outlook inbox. Microsoft Outlook includes several tools that you can use to make your inbox more organized. A rule in Microsoft Outlook is a set of actions that Outlook performs automatically when certain conditions are met. You can define the conditions for a rule using Outlook's Manage Rules and Alerts tool. A rule can be a big time saver if you often perform the same actions on similar emails. Outlook also has a rules wizard available to make the process of creating rules even easier. The rules wizard has commonly used rules already set up. All you've got to do is customize each rule in the wizard with your own choices. You can set this in advanced actions, then create rule. Here, I created a folder named a SmartSpan and created rule with a condition. Subject or body includes the text SmartSpan. Then added an action to move to newly created folder. Now, if I receive any mail with text as SmartSpan, will be automatically placed in SmartSpan folder. This will help you prioritize your email and stay organized. Tip number three, read mail in larger font. Press control button with mouse wheel up, will display the zoom option. And you can zoom the mail, it is per convenience. Tip number four, Outlook Keyboard Shortcuts Shortcut for email reply is Ctrl plus R Shortcut to forward email is Ctrl plus F Press Ctrl plus 1 to switch to mail view Press Ctrl plus 2 to get calendar Press Ctrl plus 3 to get contact list Press escape to close an email. Number 5. Sweep. Send later. Option to send email later is available in Outlook Web. Click mail to reply and compose the mail. Then in send option, you have the option of send later. Select the custom date and time and click on send button. Mail is now in drafts folder. You can still modify email and change the date and time if you wish. Sweep option can be used if you need to move all mails from one folder to another. Also, you can keep the latest email from recipient in inbox and move all other to another folder. You just need to select the option and pop up window accordingly. You can snooze email to read it later. And the mail you snoozed will be available in snoozed folder. Tip number six, attachment filter and save. Now. Let us check on email attachments. 
you have the option to save it to OneDrive directly from email. Also, we have the option to filter emails based on attachment. Means, display emails with only attachment. Tip number 7, import and export contacts. First, let me create a contact. You can add the required fields from add more option, like email address, nickname, phone and so on. Click on create once done. Now, in Manage option, you can export or download your contacts. I created a file with three records in it. I am going to import these contacts to Outlook contact list. Now, go to my contacts. Let me create a new folder named as personal. Click on Manage option, which is having the sub option of import contacts. Now, just select our file with contact details and click on Import button. You can see all three contacts are successfully added to Outlook contacts. I would like to move these contacts to the personal folder. Click on move to option and select the folder you wish to move. You can see the contacts are moved to personal folder. Last but not least, Outlook settings. Settings in Outlook web is the most useful option to customize the application as per your wish. First, let me change the theme and also change the display to dark mode. You can change reading pane as per your convenience. Let us go to settings in detail. In compose and reply option, you can create multiple signatures for new messages and replies. I am creating one signature name personal for my emails. You can see a lot of other options in this setting. You can directly save email attachments to your storage accounts like OneDrive, Google Drive and so on. Very useful feature when working with files. In Junk Email option, you can block senders and also maintain safe senders list. Also, you have settings for safe mailing list and filters. In Customize Actions, you can set quick actions. In Calendar, you can set the working days and time. In language and time, you can set language, date, and time format, current time zone. You can categorize emails for easy identification. Let us see how, how undo send option works. I am setting the timer as 10 seconds, means after sending email, you have 10 seconds to undo email from sending. This is especially useful if you identify any mistake after clicking on send button. Let me show an example on the same.
you can have separate fonts for new emails and while replying to emails. Once you set the fonts, the application will automatically pick up the font you set. Thanks for your time. Please do not forget to support my channel. Also, check out my next video.